friends today we are going to discuss about the bear villager rearrangement the reaction involves the oxidation of ketones to esters by the treatment of with per acids the reaction involves oxidation of ketones here you can see here is ketone to ester by the treatment with per acid is known as a bear villager rearrangement the overall reaction is an insertion of oxygen atom between the carbonyl and the adjacent carbon in the ketone here we can see insertion of oxygen between carbonyl and here r dash that means one of the adjacent carbon in the ketone okay so let's talk about the mechanism of bare villager rearrangement firstly carbonyl double bond takes h plus from the per acid like this so here is the formation of carbocation here is formation of oh then second molecule of per acid attack on the carbocation like this here we can see this oxygen attack on the carbocation this oxygen is not attack on the carbocation because lone pair of that oxygen are involved in the resonance like this okay so that oxygen is not attacking on the carbocation so here is the formation of our intermediate then the formation of ester is a concerted mechanism like this here this r dash group goes here and the removal of carboxylate anion takes place like this okay so here is the formation of ester here we can see carbonyl group is formed and r dash is transferred here and the carboxylate anion is removed so here is the formation of ester then the here is formation of acid okay then the migratory aptitude in the unsymmetrical ketone that means uh, r and r dash is different okay in unsymmetrical ketones that group migrates which is more electron releasing that means which is more electron donating because here is our oxygen is electro positive in nature it is electron deficient so electron donating group migrates easily so the migratory aptitude of alkyl group is tertiary alkyl is easily migrated than the secondary alkyl secondary is easily migrated than the primary and primary is easily migrated than the ch3 group okay here are some applications of bare villager rearrangement first one is the ester formation here our c6h5 group is migrate and the formation of phenyl acid takes place from acetophenone in the presence of trifluoro per acetic acid the formation of phenyl acid takes place okay then the second application is the formation of anhydrides here diacetyl that is one to here is one to diketone in the presence of per acetic acid here is formation of acetic anhydride that means this this group is migrate this whole group is migrate okay then the third application and last one application is formation of lactones here is our cyclohexanone first firstly here is the formation of carbocation then another per acetic acid molecule attack on that carbocation then the formation of our intermediate after the after the rearrangement there is formation of ester this group this ch2 is migrate over here and the formation of our lactone that means uh, here we can call it as epsilon caprolactam epsilon caprolactone is formed 
सो दिस इज द फॉर्मेशन ऑफ लैक्टोन तो ये थे हमारे आज की रिएक्शन बेर विलीजर रिएक्शन थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग